Hi, I'm Jerry Fowler, the president of the Save Darfur Coalition. As you probably know, uh, in recent weeks we've been collecting citizen sign-ons to a letter to President Obama uh, urging him to get his plan for Sudan right and to get it finished. We're pushing for a balance of incentives and pressures uh, that will move towards peace in Sudan. Uh, yesterday I had the opportunity to deliver the letter to Special Envoy Scott Gratian with the signatures of over 113,000 American citizens. One of the things that uh, I talked to General Gratian about were his recent comments uh, before the Senate Foreign Relations Committee on the issue of sanctions. Uh, he assured me that he did not call or believe that there should be a lifting of sanctions uh, on Sudan. His main concern, he said, was making sure that the sanctions did not impede development in the South. Um, in my uh, comments, I, I underscored our feeling that uh, any lifting of sanctions or providing of incentives to Khartoum could only come after concrete and lasting progress. We still have a lot of work to do. Of course, we need to be focused on the administration for them to get the plan for Sudan right uh, and to get it finished. And we would like for President Obama to roll out the plan himself to demonstrate his uh, continued personal commitment to this issue. We also have upcoming in September a very important opportunity for the President to demonstrate that commitment. He will be addressing the United Nations General Assembly in late September and the United States will be the President of the UN Security Council. Those are two great opportunities uh, for President Obama and the Obama administration to underscore their continued commitment to peace in Sudan.